Awesome, Coach. Thanks. Let's get back to second half action. Good luck. Back to you guys. Thank you, Tyler. We're back. It was a kickoff from the Wayne State Wildcat deep in the Babs and Beavers end. And kicked away there by Reed Santos. It's be a line out here early in the second half for Wayne State, just outside the 22 of Babson College. John Broker here with Thomas Wheels. Grant Wheels, good attacking position here for Wayne State, but this is anybody's game. Oh, it certainly is. It is an epic arm wrestle for sure, but as you mentioned, this is a really good opportunity for Wayne State to strike ascendancy on the beginning of the second half. Their set piece has been functioning relatively well, as it is right now. And they put a little wrap around in there. Gianni gets the ball back, gets the ball to his scrum app. That's Louis Hurley. Louis Hurley is about 10 meters out looking for a pick and go. Some of the big boys coming around. There's the number five, Ayanda Kumalo. Kumalo takes it a little further. Another pick and go, driven across to the side. Babson has been strong near their own try line of defense. Let's see if they can hold this time. Jaden James gets it out to the big hooker, and he's got some room, and over he goes. It is Bonelli Gianni, the first-year player, scoring a try here to open up the second half. National Collegiate Rugby Small College Championship. Wayne State pulls away a little further. What a try there for Gianni, and it all came off the line out. It was... A fantastic set piece move that the Wildcats set up, and they were just all poetry in motion. Everyone knew their roles. Here it is, here, Jaden James, the short pass off to Gianna, who just gave it the show and go and spliced through the gap. It's exactly what you want to see from your barnstorming number two. But this is some sort of a statement, Johnny, from Wayne State. Within the first two minutes of the second half, they have come out of the halftime talk with a bang. 